Okay. Landing get a warning horn. Okay, put that back away. You're done with that right now. Okay, and you just lost your engine. All right. Traffic, traffic, Cessna 172, we are simulating engine out. We're going to enter runway 23, Tampa Z. Check was completed, seat belts on, briefing. Ah, briefing, we're going up for a sign off, correct? Yep. Uh, you're going to be the pilot in command. Mm -hmm. I know how to work the doors. And this is the only exit. You can't get out the baggage door in this airplane. I there is a there. fire extinguisher. It's between our nice. seats. All right. So, according to this, we have here fuel selector, on both, cow flaps are open, avionics are correct, currently off. Uh, lights are off. Beacon light should be the only one on, which I uh, see here. So we should have here. Beacon is on. Gears are down and locked. Circuit breakers. We'll start from here. All good. Run across. That's the compass. So it stays popped off. Uh, this one's supposed to be off. One way to check is pull it and put it back in. Yeah. I see nothing else. Uh, second breakers before I understand. Holding brakes. Mixture. Full rich. Uh, full rich. Prop. High. Carb heat. Currently off. Prime. Do we need to prime it. On this one. First day. First start of the day. Let it fill up real good. How many do you like to give? I usually give it one to two. Uh, yeah, that's going to be pretty good right there. Yeah, because the first one's there. Come on, where is that? And it's locked. All right. Woo. Prime. Boom, 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 boom. Throttle. Order. Master switch. Master switch is going to be on. Landing gear, green light. Uh, landing gear, landing gear, landing gear, landing gear. There you go. Landing gear, yep, we got green. We got green auxiliary pump. It should be off. So on and notarized, make sure it's working. Okay. All right. It's working, back off. Back off. <coughs> notarized. As we pump this off. Clear prop! Looks both sides. We are see all clear. Start ignition.
looks good? Yeah, that, that feels about right. Uh, next one is required avionics, avionics switch. So we're going to go to runway 5, which is our normal departure runway. All right. Wow. I don't know what happened. Traffic in inch positive, Julius. Turn left crosswind, climbing through 400 for 3,000. Pardon traffic pattern section. Traffic. All right, taxi flaps up. Uh, flaps up up. Indicator set. Just almost. Uh, pop it back out. Uh, there uh -huh. you go. The compass tech. Altitude indicator. Okay. Uh, so, heading indicator, turn coordinator. Yeah, looks about right. So we'll check those while we're moving. Yep. All right, I'm going to check my brakes, and then you can check yours. Okay. Brakes are good. Your control. Okay, I have the controls. My brakes work. Back to 1,000. There you go. You have the controls. I got the controls. You have it? I have it. So when you're getting a jet? Yeah. <laughs> Not this year. Clear right. And we're clear to the left. So our airspeed indicator reads zero, attitude indicator's up and erect, altimeter reads within 75 feet, turns in the direction of the turn, ball goes opposite, swings freely, and note what it reads. Instrument check. Nobody on final. I don't see anybody coming that way. Tampa is like traffic, this has a 172 Delta Papa. We're going to take it runway 5, 4, a straight out departure. Tampa is Lights, camera, action, we're all good. I would go in a little more with that mixture for takeoff. Yeah, perfect. And we got birds at the end. On the sun line, all right, here we go, nice and easy. Here's to the ground. Airspeed's alive. We got 50, rotation. Right rudder on climb out. Yep. A lot of right rudder. A lot of right rudder. There we go. All right. You like to do full runway and then gears up? Uh, I do no more usable runway. No more. Tap the brakes, gear up. All right, tap the brakes, gear up. No reds, no greens. We are good. All right. 500 feet. Coming up on 500. 85 on a climb, 85, 95 on a climb. What else do we do through 500 feet? 500 feet. Show up here, climb checklist, how you call it, landing lights are off. Landing lights are off. Pressure 25 on the RPM. Okay. Nope, not the mixture. Oops. <laughs> Power 25 on the RPM. So 25 inches on the manifold. Nice. 
25 on the propeller. And 25 on a prop. Alright, 25, 20, we're close to it, 25, 25 on climb. Yep. And that's the way you like it, 25, 25? Yep. Alright. Yep, so you use full power on almost all complex until you're through 500 feet, your critical altitude, and then you go 25, 25 because you're typically redlining at those speeds. So that's 25, 25 for climb. Alright. Time for the traffic, 172 Delta Papa. We are departing the upwind and leaving the pattern uh, to the uh, west. Correction to the east. Time for the Okay. All right, you want to climb up to 2,500? Uh, let's go to 2,000. All right, 2,000 feet. And uh, while we're on our way to 2,000, can you climb me there at um, 70? At uh, speed 70? Airspeed 70. All right. So we pitch for airspeed, power for altitude. Climbs real nice at 70, nice and stable. Okay, at 2,000 feet, level off, and I'd like for you to give me a cruise checklist. All right, level off at 2,000. All right, manifold pressure to 15 to 25, 15, 25. So we're going to go to 15. Oh, uh, so that's the differential, right? So between 15 and 25? Yep. There's a chart that I keep in the airplane. This is 2,000 feet. So we're always the above standard. Correct, for humidity. And this airplane loves 2,400 RPMs. So if we do 24 and then manifold, let's see, if we did 24, 23, because we're not trying to go real far, Right. Uh, then we're getting 128 burning 8 gallons an hour, so that sounds good. Okay. So how about 23 on your manifold and 24 on your RPMs? 23 on the manifold pressure, 1, 2, and 23, and you said 24 on, very sensitive. Uh-huh. Okay, what else is on your cruise checklist? On the cruise checklist, trim set, landing lights off, cow flaps, cow flaps is closed. Do you want to close the cow flaps? What do you think? Do we need to close them? No. No, the te cylinder head temperature is pretty warm right now, so we're okay. Yep. So the cow flaps closed, make sure it's lean, and then uh, heading into cutter check. So we've got uh, 020. Zero zero. All right, go zero 020. Zero. Okay, let's go ahead and lean the mixture. Show me that you know how to do that, because this plane runs rich. Runs rich. So we're going to pull back. There you go. Prop set, 24. Let's lean this mixture out. Yep. So the, we'll just lean it till it runs a little rough, and then about three turns in. You want three, okay. That's a little rough there. One, two. Right about there. Okay, perfect. That sounds good. Okay, then we monitor our cylinder head temperature to make sure we didn't over lean it. Yep. Yep. Okay, let's go ahead and go... Uh, Still feels a little rough. It does feel a little rough. That's what I was going to point out. Very yeah. good. A little rough. I think that feels a little better. It does. We'll go ahead and pull back just a little bit here. Okay. Give me a, uh, let's see, let's go, go right heading 210. Yeah, right turn heading 210, one, uh, 172 Delta Papa. All right, read that correct. And look what those guys were talking about, it's nice out here. I know, right? Yeah, okay, and in that turn heading 210, I want to do that at 80. At 80. 80, mm -hmm. and, 80 knots. Yep, and 2,000 feet. Looking out the window for traffic. Yep, for traffic.
Nice pitches for airspeed, powers for altitude. Nice, okay. On heading 210, let's set power to, um, we'll hold 2200. We were in a nice descent, that's good. Let's set our power to 20 inches of manifold pressure, which is a nice cruise power setting if we're going to maneuver. Show me a steep turn to the left whenever you're ready with the manifold pressure at 20. And then we're going to go back to the traffic pattern and beat it up a couple times. All right, manifold pressure is 20. Yeah. There we go, there we go, manifold pressure, we set at 20. Uh huh. 2200. Okay. And steep turns. I should have known you was going to do this to me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to look for the right. We're clear, we're going to look to the left. Very clear. And you did set to the left? Uh, yes, sir, to the left. All right, to the left, 45. Back through 30, we add a little back pressure. We're just looking out the window, enjoying the flight. As it settles in, we feel that 1.5 Gs that we're pulling. You have good control of the airplane. Let's go ahead and go back to Tampa Exec and do a couple of traffic patterns. All right. All right, that's Plant City, so Tampa Exec, is that way? All right, there goes the pond. <laughs> I see the airport from here. Okay. All right. Tampa Exec traffic, 172 Delta Papa. We're approximately about five miles uh, to the east and bound for the uh, left downwind for runway five. It's Tampa Exec. We'll just do a uh, normal landing this time. And then right. I'm going to give you a couple of emergencies. We'll go around two more times and do a couple of emergencies. Got you. Okay, what's best glide speed if we lost the engine in this airplane right now? Best glide speed? I believe it was 65. Emergency checklist. So right now we're going to be descending, so let's go through the descent checklist. Okay, good. A uh, few selectors on both. We have it on both. Uh, carburetor required. You like carburetor down to uh, 1,000? Um, I usually, anytime, just like a regular one, if I'm out of the green, I'll turn carburetor heat on. Gotcha. And we do have a carb temp gauge. If it's in the yellow, that's when we're susceptible to carb ice. So if okay. it's not in the yellow, technically you don't have to use it. Okay. Tap exec traffic, uh, 172 Delta Papa, we're about four miles, we're going to end at 45 for the left downwind for runway 5, tap exec. Alright, descent checklist, passenger briefing, we're going to do a couple touch and goes, we're going to go through the cycle. A few selectors above, car B required manifold pressure, we have to monitor the manifold pressure. Alright. It says here, manifold pressure, make sure enrich and slowly, and then trim uh, set. Uh, that volume was way down. <laughs> Tampa Zig traffic, a Cessna 172 Delta Papa. We are entering the 45 for the left side wind for runway 5. Touch and goes. All right, landing gears under 40. So we're pretty good here to put the landing gears down. Uh-huh. All right, all right. We'll hold on to it. So that's only attached to the nose gear, so we have Correct. to... Uh, and I don't see it yet. Uh, I don't see it, all right, so we have no gears. Uh-huh. Okay, I guess know. we need an emergency checklist. An emergency checklist for no gears. Wing line, line detected, landing gears, and flap to maintain the pump. Let's go, engine. Nope, nope, fire, fire, engine, engine, landing gears. There you go. 
Alright, one let's hold down to uh, landing gear fair landing gears that master switch is on. Master switch we know is on, master switch landing gear level uh check up. So check it one more time. And put it back in the down position. Did anything down. happen? Nope. Alright. We're gonna stay stay at this altitude because we don't wanna go into Tampa A into the Bravo. Level circuit breakers, landing gear circuit breakers will be. I don't see anything popped here. Unless you have it. No, oh, circuit breakers, circuit breakers. Oh, but let's leave it out. Okay. Tricked you. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay, continue oh. through your checklist. I'll yep. watch for traffic and listen. All right, so the gear goes up. All right. Now this puppy is. We pull out or straight up? Pull it straight out. And then up. And then pump it. While you fly the airplane. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I see a tire coming. That's about 12. Well, no, it's down and locked because our green light will come on. Okay. I can feel the resistance, so I know it's coming down. Hey, there's our green light. Executive executive green light. Now, now this stays up. Uh, so now it three. will, yes. Okay. Okay, Woo. I'm going to push the gear pump back in. Thank you. <laughs> and stow that. Okay, take us in for a landing. I'll have to push it in when we get on the ground. All right. So let's go back. All right. We're just going to overfly the airport, but we're going to be just overfly. Look, enter downwind for 2-3 this yeah. time, since it's calm. Alright. Tampa exec traffic, Cessna 172 Delta Papa. We're going to be entering the left downwind for runway 2-3, Tampa exec. Nice. Nice job on that checklist. Alright, let's uh, retract the gears up. <laughs> Just for now. Tampa Executive Helicopter SO1, we're going to make a right base, runway 36. Going to Sheriff's Office, hangar south end of the field. Tampa exec. Okay. Alright. Okay. Landing gear warning horn. Okay, put that back away. You're done with that for now. Okay, and you just lost your engine. All right. Tap a jet traffic, that's the 172. We are simulating engine out. We're going to enter runway 23, tap a jet. We're going to be looking for that. Executive helicopter, so what? Final runway 36, want to share something kind of stop in the field, tap a jet. Glide gives up. Don't hold us up in the air. It was over 75. And gear is down. Had plenty of time. Nice. Let's go one more time. Alright. That was nice. That's what I'm talking about. Thank you. And an airplane you've never landed. There she's alive. Right, right. Right, 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 right. Well, you really got to get right, right on this puppy. Yeah, it's got some power. Yeah, it does. So think about that and the go around. Yep. If you lost your engine, where are you landing right now? And you know, right now, well, either try to chop it right there real quick or find a strip, right a canal right in there. Okay. I don't mind putting it, that's what we got insurance. <laughs> Top exec traffic, Cessna 172, Delta Papa, we enter in the left downwind for runway 23, Top exec. Okay, we'll just do this as a normal landing. Yes, ma'am. Top exec traffic, Cessna 172, Delta Papa, with beam numbers, we enter in the left base for runway 23. All right. All right, gears are visual. Yep, 
and the nose. And we gear. have gear, and we have green. Nice. Aircraft on base for uh, executive. This is 65 Fox. I'm going to do a 360 out at Erky uh, for spacing, and then I'll come in behind you. Oh, in sight. We got you in sight. Then tap basic traffic, uh, Cessna 172, Delta Pompa turning final for runway 23, touch and go. Here is down. Here is down a lot. Nice. All right, flaps up. Okay. Hold on. Carburetor heat off. Engine gauges are in the game. Green, green. Your speed's alive. There we go. Tampa Zek traffic, Cessna 172 Delta Papa. We are on the upwind. Tampa Zek. Positive rate of climb. We are going to gears up. Zek traffic, Skyline 65 Fox, out three miles. No mile. reds, no greens. Two, three, full stop. Okay, let's see. Yeah, I hear you. I hear you. Do you have a set spot where you put the gear down? I usually do. Uh -huh. I like to do a beam. A beam the numbers? Beam the numbers. Right. My personal, if you want me to do it differently. Oh, no. Uh, it's fine. As long as you have a set spot, as long as it's not just before I land. No, no. I will never wait that long. Yeah. Because I, if, if you get the situation where you don't, I call you don't see the gears. Yeah. You know. That's right. You want to be able. Yep. All right. I have a tire. Green. I got a tire. And we got a green light. What if your oil pressure read low right now? What would you expect? Uh, and your roughness, and it might seize. Yeah, so we could expect imminent engine failure. Right what if your amp meter had a high rate of charge right now? Ooh, we might get a static a static charge. Yeah, maybe our starter's engaged, or something's wrong. Maybe, what would you do? Ah, uh, good question, I don't know. Turn something else, turn the electrical stuff off. Turn the electrical so stuff. So it doesn't create a fire or something, yeah. even if it's the master switch. Yeah. Tampa Exec Traffic, Cessna 172 Delta Papa on the left base for runway uh, 23, Tampa Exec. Can we turn the master switch off right now? Yes. We'll lose our radios, but we'll have... Engine won't quit. Okay. Uh. Tampa Exec Traffic, Cessna 172 final for runway 23, Tampa Exec. All right, carbs ease in. I got green, flaps. I am happy for you to check out this airplane. Um, it, we have been flying only 0.7. Okay. So if you want a flight review, we need to go around the traffic pattern one more time. That's what I'm telling you. Okay. But then you said, oh, we got a ugly bug in Ooh. here. Ooh. Nice. Traffic helicopter SO1, departing 1-8. We'll be right close to traffic 1-8. Stay in uh, south of 2-3. Uh, we'll be doing uh, practice auto rotations. Just south of uh, runway 1A. All 
Robbie's in. All right. We got rotation speed. Engine's still in green. Everything's in green. And we're going to leave the gears down. Traffic uh, Cessna 172 Delta Papa, we're on the L way. We're going to remain in the pattern one more time. Tampa Zex. One traffic unicorn, sky hold free down November radio check, please. Heading due west. the uh, helicopter that's in the pattern. Yep. And we got the helicopter in sight at uh, Tampa Executive. And that's the one we have you in sight also. Where's the helicopter? He must have landed. Yeah, he was going in for a landing. Okay. And then check the gears. Gears are down. Visual on the tire. You got, got a tire? A, I got a tire. Alright. What was that? I don't know. <laughs> that was the gear pumping the pressure up. Oh really? Yeah. That's what the pop is? Okay. Yep. So yeah, if we had a high amp meter reading, it could mean just that, that we had uh, the gear pump was stuck on or something. So we could try pulling the gear motor so we don't burn it up or catch on fire. Right. I don't know what the weather briefer was talking about. Gorgeous day out here. Yep. Staff Executive Helicopter SO-1 departing the south end of runway 18 for right close traffic. We're going to stay south of runway 23. Traffic Executive Traffic, Cessna 172 Delta Papa. We're turning uh, left base for runway 23. Traffic Executive, full stop. All right, we're going to put one notch of gear, one notch of flaps. And I would just Have about... Have traffic at Cherokee, 3631 kilos, five mile final, straight in, runway 23. Be touch and go. Five mile final. Five mile final. Center line, we may gotta make it look good. Pitch of 70. Final. Pitch of speed, powerful altitude. Yes. Bit of a left crosswind. Hit that hash mark there. Hash mark. There we go. Gears down. Gears down a lot. Nice. How do you like that one? I like it. We still haven't used up the time. <laughs> it didn't even tick over. It took us less than six minutes to oh, go around there. Wow. Oh, we'll do it next time. Okay. I appreciate it. Nice control of the airplane. Oh, very yeah. nice job when I was getting you very busy uh, controlling it and remaining PIC. Thank you. We strive for excellence. Yes. Okay, I'll find up for 2-3, Tampa Exec. How far are you now? Uh, Delta Papa, we just clear runway 2-3. Taxi into the FBO. Oh, uh, Cherokee it took a light out. Final, two, the lawnmower three. did. Yeah. They're right. Tampa Exec, Tampa Exec, Skyhawk 3 down the road. It's going to take off on the 2-3. Uh, make a southbound departure, Tampa Exec. So don't forget in this airplane, after you land, lean, lean aggressively. Lean aggressively. Yeah. There you go. Where do you want me to park it? Well, I think on, Tampa, on the front line executive there, executive if we can. 865, Mike Tango, taxing 23 from uh, Mag. Tampa. Tampa's at traffic, I hold 3 down remember it's up in Lame 23, Tampa's at traffic. And Tampa's at traffic, I'll go to SO1, we're right down wind, we'll be working the uh, 
Departure in a 1 8, south in a 1 8. Right. Uh -huh. Doing uh, auto rotations to the uh, field just to the south of uh, runway 1 8. That's so one. We have you in flight. We're just going to remain here uh, 300 feet past on here. All right. Okay, yeah, we'll get you inside also. We won't be any factor. Flight plan calls, 1,000 RPM. All right, there we go. Avionics switch is off. Cherokee's half mile. And for those that don't know, this is Michelle, my flight instructor. She is from, how you call it? Say your... Superior Aviation Gateway. There you go, at Tampa Executive. Come and check us out. All right, you're going to shut it down. Avionics is off. Every on saw lights and beacons, beacons, lights off, and a mixture cut off. All right, ignition, master switch.